Hello YouTube, and today we are doing tutorial 2 for our Minecraft Power Network. Okay, so let's begin. Last time we forgot to do some of the um, in oh my God, initialization events. So, we're going to start off by doing some of these events. So we'll start off with the pre-initialization event. We are going to import event handler, and then we're going to import FML pre-initialization event. And then I'm just going to copy this because we're going to do it a few more times. Okay, so then we're just going to do the regular init, and then the regular initialization event, and then we're going to do the posting it okay there here we go okay so then in the actual initialization event we're gonna initialize a couple things so we don't have to do it later so we're gonna do I don't know why this is not wanting to work today proxy dot register renders proxy dot register tile entities Okay. And then that's the last thing we're going to do in this class. Okay. And um, for now, this is all we're going to put in the reference class. There's more stuff we may put in later. Okay. So, the next thing we are going to do is going to be the fun part. We are going to start the actual power network. And we're going to start with the base backbone of the power network. So, we are going to create an emblem, emblem, whatever those things are called in the lib class, call it energy, energy, okay, um, I do not know why that's like that, that's bugging me. You know what? I am actually going to tr I am actually going to no oh, whoops I'm going to delete this class because it is messing up for some odd reason okay so we are just gonna have it create a class instead called energy. Okay, I really don't know why it's doing this. Okay, it's doing it on uh, every one of them. I will figure that out later. Okay. So the first thing we need to do Oh, yeah. Let me change this back to an emblem. E N uh, E N U M. Oh, here we go. This is why. Um, this is supposed to be one. Um, that didn't change anything. Okay, well, alright, so we'll start off with the actual name of the power network. So I'm just going to call it Tutorial. Okay. And then in brackets, I'm just going to call it Tutorial again. Tutorial again. 
and then outside of the brackets I do comma space and then I'm just gonna call it tut for this one actually I'll do all caps tut and then I will do that okay that's really bugging me if anybody knows what why it's doing this please um, if you can tell me oh unless is no that's not it I, I, I really don't know what that is alright well alright so we're going to do energy and it's gonna be um, have it cast string name and then string string symbol s y m b o l okay okay and then and then we're going to do this dot name equals name and then we're going to do this dot whoops this dot oh my god this dot s okay I don't know why it's being stubborn this dot symbol okay I'll have to do that later alright so this dot symbol equals symbol s y m b o l alright and then it's gonna be public static get name is what we're gonna call it get name And then we're going to return name. Okay. Oh, duh. I'm si I I know why. I know why this isn't working correctly. So we need to do private string name and then private string symbol and then there Okay. Wait, not public string. This should be public string. There we go. And then after publics, after after we get name, we are going to public string. and then we're gonna we're going to get the symbol okay okay we're going to get the symbol and then we're going to return we're going to return symbol Okay, and then, and then we'll do this. I, I like to do this. Public static string. Get plural. Uh, 
Okay. Oh my god, I did it again. I don't know why I always put static. It's just a force of habit. And then we are going to return the name plus S. There. Okay, so we have finished that class. That is the very, very backbone. And I think that is pretty good for this tutorial for this video so I'll see you in the next tutorial this has been Andrew bye